Um, everybody worries about cold traffic. Like, like, you know, it's funny. I can go into a Facebook group or anybody can, and they can, they can post a screenshot and say, um, they can say something like, you know, oh, look, I got 20X ROI. And the first question everybody says is, oh, well, is that warm traffic? And then the guy goes, yeah, it's warm traffic. And then everybody goes, oh, well, yeah, whatever. <laughs> right? And to me, that's the dumbest fucking thing in the world because how do we make warm traffic? Like if you're getting 20, 30, 40, 50X ROI on warm traffic, what does that tell you? It tells you you need to create more warm traffic, right? So what I do is I run cold advertisements and I don't care if I go one to one. I mean, I usually average between three to one and four to one. So if I put a dollar in, I get four out, right? So if I spend a thousand bucks, I might make three or four grand. And, or sometimes I'll spend a thousand bucks and make a thousand bucks and that's fine on dead cold traffic. And when I say that, I mean, people bought right then and there on the webinar, but if though, once those people are out of that and they are now in my retargeting campaigns and my follow-up, what are they now? They're fucking warm traffic, right? So the secret is retargeting. The secret is follow-up. The secret is warm traffic. You can make a lot of money on warm traffic. So make more warm traffic, create more, you know, oh, that's warm traffic. And then nobody pays attention to what, no, make more warm traffic. Okay. Like, duh. Okay. So what I do is I focus on running as many ads as I can uh, to cold traffic and making them warm and then hitting them with the follow-up and making my money there. I don't worry if I don't make money on the cold or if I only make a few bucks. I worry about creating warm traffic because that's where my 20, 30, 40, 50 X ROI is. Boom, done. That's it. This is really interesting because um, as, as you're talking, uh, it becomes really apparent that you're, you're very focused on knowing, knowing your numbers at each stage from, you know, whether it's cold, whether it's warm, um, you know, at every stage of maybe the, the buying cycle or the customer journey, if you like. So what are the main numbers that you're generally uh, tracking? Okay, so I'll flip the script on you a little bit. A lot of people look at cost per click, cost per lead. Um, Cost per attendee, cost per uh, oh uh, CPM, blah blah blah. I don't really look at most of those numbers, right? I don't. I look at cost, like money in, money out. So like when I run cold ads, I've found and I've run a lot. I've found that I can run ads where I get two dollar webinar registrations, and I'll make two x ROI. But then I run another ad set where I get um, where I get five or six dollar, or maybe even seven dollar uh, webinar registrants, right? But I'll make four x ROI. You see, so at the end of the day, what matters is how much you spend and how much you made. And I believe that a lot of those metrics, like cost per lead, cost per click, those are distractions. Um, and you really have to spend the money and look at it over time.